A landslide in the city of Ketchikan in extreme southeast Alaska has killed at least one person and injured at least three, local officials said. Some residents have been ordered to evacuate as officials warn another slide could strike nearby. Multiple homes, businesses and roadways were significantly damaged when the landslide tore down a hillside in the coastal city of Ketchikan. In my 65 years in Ketchikan, I have never seen a slide of this magnitude, Ketchikan Mayor Dave Kiffer said. The loss of life that we have encountered is heartbreaking, and my heart goes out to those who lost their homes, he added. Governor Mike Dunleavy issued an Alaska Disaster Emergency Declaration. A mandatory evacuation order has been issued for residents on 3rd Avenue, 2nd Avenue, 1st Avenue, and White Cliff Avenue between Austin and Natto Streets. The Ketchikan High School is set up as an emergency shelter with water, food, and blankets. The Saxman Community Center has been identified as a second emergency shelter site. The slide blocked the 3rd Avenue bypass, as well as other roads in the area. Crews cleared downed power lines that were interfering with rescue efforts. The borough confirmed that power has been restored to nearby homes but power on 1st and 2nd avenues in the slide zone will likely be down for an extended period of time. Authorities have advised avoiding the area until further notice. Our prayers are with the families, the injured, those recovering, and the community, Senator Dan Sullivan said on social media, later adding, my team and I stand ready to help facilitate any federal assistance that may be necessary. This just happened. See, this went down. Can't even wait to 911. Um, you need to get out of here, Dad. Yeah, I'll tell you what. Again, from got the landslide there. It's got the bypass right here. Yeah, it's blocked, I'm sure. Fire department over there and all sorts of things.